Hi, welcome back to my channel. Um, my name is Harris, for those of you who are new. My channel is a little bit of everything. Makeup, getting ready, skincare, groceries, organization, a little bit of everything for everyone. Um, this video is gonna be a little bit shorter video. I had originally, I had originally filmed a video that was supposed to go up this past Tuesday, but some things happened, so it just, it didn't work out the way I wanted it to. So this one is going to be um, our little mini grocery haul of what we bought. Um, this one was part of uh, this month because I I think I went on one. I did one like $10 little mini grocery like where I just went and got some fruits and veggies. And then I had about, for my budget, about $60 left to get this one. It was a little bit over, but that's fine. It's not a big deal because it is going to go into next month. So yeah so um i'm just gonna get ready really quickly before we have to head to walmart and then yeah so hope you like subscribe and let's just go ahead and get ready baby girl is sleeping so i'll have to get her ready when she wakes up so i'm not really doing too much for my makeup i just want to make sure i can cover these bags up because the bags are real her she's sleeping a little bit better but because she's teething and she's getting more of her front teeth in it's been a little bit more difficult to um for her to get a full like good night's sleep which really um after talking to her doctor about it she said that's perfectly normal um she's growing really well and she's eating really good she's not a very big fan of um the baby pasta we bought it's like softer and just easier for them to digest she's not a very big fan of it so we're hoping she slowly will become a big fan of it just so that way she has a better um palette of like the things that she likes to eat when she's older and she's not like a picky picky eater and then she likes yogurt we bought um, us organic baby yogurt which you'll see today because we have to pick up some more she really likes it um her doctor gave it all clear to eat it so i was really happy she really likes it she um she's not that picky when it comes to yogurts or sweets she's not a very big fan of them but she also will eat them will eat it so yeah i don't have bags no more it's a phenomenal so being a mom is a lot of work, um, but I'm using the camera like a mirror, and that hurt. But yeah, so Amir is doing really good. Hubby's doing really good. Um, we got her Valentine's Day outfit. Originally, I wanted to get a dress for her, but it just didn't work out because most of the dresses just because we like to take her with us when we pick out her clothes now so she can have a say and she just did not like it the dress that like we are showing the dresses we were showing her she wasn't very excited about but she got excited about like this tutu skirt she was like you know what i'm just gonna give it to her i'm gonna get it for her and it was at walmart so it's actually gonna be in the hall today because um we got it yesterday so we're just gonna add it into this one and show everything at the same time and then the shirt, um, I'll probably upload another video, like a video of the Valentine's Day pictures we'll be taking with her or we'll be doing for her. And then we had to figure out her birthday outfit, even though we're not throwing a party or anything this year because of COVID and we just want everyone to be safe. And since we know quite a few people who don't like to quarantine and who think it's infringing upon their rights, to not wear a mask and all that so we basically were just like we're not gonna do a birthday party and if you're not gonna take this whole pandemic seriously then so be it we just won't really be around you as much and you won't get to know Amira so we've had to make that decision quite a bit like I don't mind wearing a mask I can easily wear a mask but and that's only because I care about others. I care about my daughter. I care about my health. And honestly, even after this pandemic is over, I'll more than likely still wear it. 
because I like wearing a mask. Like, I don't have to worry about this half of my face. Like, people don't ask, like, come up and be like, oh, you should smile more. Like, they leave me alone, so. And even before the pandemic, when, like, I got the flu, like, before Amira was born, I got the flu, my doctor said to wear a mask. It's cautionary, so. I wore one before the pandemic actually hit. And then it just, we ended up having to always wear it, which really isn't that bad. I mean, sometimes we forget it in the car and we have to, like, run back. But... It's not too bad. I don't really see what, why everyone gets, like, why people get angry over wearing it. Like, it's really simple to put it on. And it means you're protecting others, you're protecting yourself. What's the big issue? So. And then, um, but yeah, so. My husband and I were talking earlier and over the last couple weeks we've really thought about it we don't know if we actually want another baby because we love having a mirror we love like just being a three-person household and it's pretty smooth sailing it's pretty easy so we don't know if we really want another baby and especially since like the way my pregnancy started and how bad it was and like all the throwing up and going to the hospital and getting the IVs. It was worth it in the end, but do I really want to go through that again for a second child? I don't like the way this is turning out. Ugh. Okay. Just gonna fill it in a little bit more. This is why I should always bring on the mirror. I'm so stupid. Anyways, so yeah, and then like, I don't know, it's just, I feel like, ooh. oh, about this setup. Um, the room that I was in is Amira's room. And since uh, we're moving her crib into there, we had to move my desk and everything out here because we don't want it in the room because that's just for sleeping and taking naps and that's it. So we want that room to be very relaxing. So we had to move my stuff out here. And so my makeup, all my makeups are in my bag. And I've been taking anything out. I don't know actually where I'm gonna put them. So we will see. But yeah, that looks about it. Let me see. I wanted to put on like foundation cause I haven't put on any foundation this year. I know it's only January, but I really wanted to put some on. But now that I'm thinking about it, I really don't want to put anything on because my skin is like, it's better. It's not like as it was before I got pregnant, but I'm going to be wearing a mask. Oh my gosh, it's a force of habit. But yeah, so it i'm gonna have to put this off but we're gonna go get because i have my coffee back there on her high chair since she's sleeping um i'm gonna finish that and then we're gonna so i'm gonna go change the laundry do all that good stuff but yeah so i think that's it um so let's go ahead we'll get into the next part of this video which is going to be the grocery haul um again make sure you like subscribe and the prices of everything that i bought is going to be also listed in the grocery haul and also maybe down below but i'll just see how i feel about that yeah so yeah i hope you guys have a great day and go ahead and enjoy the next part mm -hmm.